Duh. Guys. I'm not having it. I'm not having it. You look like a Cinderella. I hope I don't. <laughs> I called my ex. Moral of the story, don't drink, don't get into strangers' cars. Yes, I know, I look fabulous. I said to her, I was like, it's taking out the lead to not punch you in the face right now. And good morning, New York! Woo! It's a good day today. Ugh. Guys, oh my goodness, let's say good morning. Hello to the construction workers across the street. Oh my goodness! <laughs> I'm still not over the fact that I'm literally in New York right now. Good morning. Um, I woke up like this. Let's get ready to take on the day. <laughs> Let's get myself together. Um, right now, let's get ready. Let's go get breakfast. Let's visit Times Square. I also have my COVID test to go and do so I can fly back to England on Friday. Today's Wednesday. I need to get a COVID test so I can go back to England. Oh my goodness, why is my voice like this in the mornings? <sighs> like a wet little drowning rat. So yeah, let's get ready to go explore. Getting dressed, putting this um, blue dress on. The issue is it's really short and I'm gonna spend my entire time today just like pulling it down. It's also really hot. So, oh wow, okay, no, I have to wear this. Like what would I be doing if I didn't wear this? I don't know. It's short, but it's really cute. Ooh, I look fabulous. Well, I think we're ready to explore. Let's go! I'm not gonna bother doing my makeup right now. I got these Ray-Bans the other week. I got them from a thrift store and they were literally like 50 bucks, so... Steals the deals! Am I right, ladies? Duh! When am I wrong? <laughs> 540 Rouge Baccarat. Mm, ready to take on New York and be the hottest person to walk the planet. <laughs> Dress, pulling bar, jacket, all saints, shoes are Nike. Bag Chanel, heartless. I did a mini coffee stop. We have a Starbucks right here. We have an oat milk latte with four shots of espresso and sugar free vanilla syrup. I'm going to go get a bagel because, oh, look at me. That's what I'm like most excited about. Let's almost get run over. Hi. <laughs> Oops. Oh, it's a full brick. Look at the selections. They have all the fillings. Okay guys, so I got my bagel. I just got an everything bagel with plain cream cheese. Wow. Oh, guys, are you kidding me? Guys. This is like literally the best bagel I've ever had in my entire life. Like it's like so and chewy in the inside and so crispy in the outside. Wow. 10 out of 10 for coming back here. Wow. Guys, I just got my uh, COVID test done. That was really quick and easy. It's 12.30, so I have like an hour. I might head back to my hotel and start getting ready. Wow. This is literally the coolest thing. Guys, we've made a pet stop. Pets. I'm getting a coffee. We have a ginger shot. I just feel like a ginger shot is needed. My stomach hurts. It's like full of liquid. <laughs> I am so full right now. Like this is all liquid. I got a little liquid baby. Wow. He was very, very handsome. I'm back at my hotel now. My stomach really hurts because of all the coffee I've been having and probably from the gluten and dairy from the bagel. Was that bagel worth it? Absolutely. That was the best bagel I've had in my life. <laughs> but I'm gonna do my makeup. My friend I made yesterday, she's coming to New York today with a couple of her friends. We're gonna go and take Instagram pictures. I'm very excited. I'm gonna do like a full face of makeup today just because I wanna take Instagram pictures. <laughs> Okay guys, so I'm all ready to go. I've got my bag, I've got everything, and yeah, let's head off to New York. Let's go. So guys, I'm at Chacha Matcha. I got my purple drink. I need to find the lid. 
this is the reality of my whole trip. Um, I've just been in my hotel room wasting an hour that I'm having in New York City, just like stressing the past like month of my life and just situations and just like people and this trip is not about that this trip is about exploring and having adventure and having fun and finding myself i quickly put on a different change of clothes we have my top from pullumba jeans from brandy comfy shoes and i think i'm just gonna like head off now like i I just can't do this, like, I'm just, like, stressed, like, I'm not having it, I'm not having it, I'm not having it, I'm not having it, I just, like, I just need to go out, I just need to, f I just need to leave, like. I'm home editing this video, and I actually have no idea why I'm having a breakdown. I'm trying to remember, but I don't know, I I'm guessing it was something to do with my ex. I need to get up, I need to do something, I just, I'm, ha I'm having a breakdown. I'm, like, trying, I'm, like, I'm about to have a breakdown. That's it. I'm not having one. I'm about to. I've just been snacking on like a bunch of these cinnamon little bites. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't know what I'm gonna do. What do I do? Let's go to Central Park. Let's go have a picnic. Let's go get a piece of pizza and go to Central Park and walk around and just maybe then just okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go somewhere. Let's fucking go. I wrote all this self help book so you think that I. Okay, I'm singing Olivia Rodrigo in the elevator. This was definitely a breakdown about my ex. <laughs> Roaming the streets of New York. Guys, I decided to do a little horse and carriage ride through Central Park. <gasps> this is actually so cool. Central Park is so pretty, like I really just want to live here. What's his name again? King. King. Oh, that's so cool. Uh, Cinderella horse. And you look like a Cinderella. <laughs> so nice. Now I'm just walking to the Focus. I'm walking to this like paint and pour place where you can just paint at a cafe, really cool. Look how fun this is. I'm like walking just around Central Park. If I'm gonna be 1,000% honest, I've spent this entire trip debating whether I tell my ex or not to fly out because he was supposed to and then I told him not to. I'm home editing this and I feel like I'm just talking about my ex like way too much. But actually, I'm just being really honest. Am I being too honest? Is this just stuff I should be keeping to myself? Probably. Oh, this is how I've been feeling. Deal with it. And now I'm here and I'm having so much fun, but like also it's taking a lot of strength inside of me to not reach out to that. Ugh. I don't know whether I'm like proud of myself for not like for, like saying no and like using this time to myself or if like seeing him would be a good thing. I just, yeah, it's a lot. Whatever, I'm just going to keep walking. I have a bunch of streets to go. I'm on West 77th Street. I got to get a West 121st Street, something like that. So I just spent $11 on an Uber to paint and pour just to realize it's not like a casual cafe you just walk in and paint it's like you have to book the class and get the tickets and all that stuff the things you see in new york i also saw a rat earlier just walking across the street so there's that too i really feel at home in a place i just got a new uber all the way back to my hotel. Well, actually, no, no, no. I actually got it to Joe's Pizza, but I'm gonna have to change it, I think, back to my hotel because I just got invited out. So I asked my friends if they know any, like, promoters or whatever. And I got invited out to a, like, dinner. Oh my fucking god, that I just saw a rat crawl into a hole. So I'm back at my hotel. I just took off my makeup because I guess I'm getting ready to redo it. I was gonna take a shower and do my hair, but, like, I don't really need to. It's clean enough. I'm just gonna redo my makeup instead. Okay, so I just steamed my dress. It's from Zara. It was really wrinkly before. I'm so excited to go out tonight. Do I know who these people are? No. <laughs> but my friend that recommended me these people to hang out with does know them. So that's good enough for me. Let's go. Okay, so I just did my eyes apart from mascara. I'm gonna do that at the end. Foundation time. I haven't done my makeup routine in this order in a really long time. But sometimes it's nice to just switch things up. I feel like I get things done faster. Okay, makeup is fully on and complete. Time to deal with my hair that never wants to cooperate with me. So I'm just fully straightening my hair. I'm gonna go get dressed. 
<laughs> okay, so my dress is on and I'm running a little late like always so yeah, but that is The look it's a little wrinkled even though like I already oh, how is it already wrinkled this dress wrinkles super easily But oh well, um, okay. Yeah, I'm ready. I look fabulous, too yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hope I Good morning guys. Hello New York. How are you doing? Last night was a rough one. I had a lot of fun last night. Like, wow. I went out, I got dinner, I went to the club, and I made two really, really good friends. Katie and Jasmine. Shout out to you guys. So sweet. Also this morning, I woke up at 7 a.m. My phone was dead. I charged it now. I called my ex. He literally fell asleep like five times on the phone to me. So I blocked him. <laughs> I'm like, I've had so many manic episodes <laughs> since I've woken up. Like I've had so many like mental breakdowns since I've been awake. I don't know how last night I ended up in a Lamborghini Aventador and a Phantom. <laughs> I don't know how I ended up doing any of this shit. So yeah, I can't believe I'm leaving tomorrow and today's my last full day. Like the time here has gone by way too fast. I guess I'm gonna go get ready for brunch now. I don't know what's going on with these vlogs. Like I'm supposed to be getting picked up at 11. It is 10.30. So I have 30 minutes right now to get ready and put myself together. Probably would have liked to wash my hair, but I don't think I'm gonna have time for that now. I just posted an Instagram picture, so go like it. We only have the, um, the different models. And Hi guys, I am literally butt ass naked right now and the entirety of New York City can probably see me So you're welcome blessing the view with a view. It also look like a little egg right now because I have a hair mask in Let's go put clothes on Today I walked Cornelia Street because of Taylor Swift Actually, today I've done like almost 20,000 steps So can I can I hear that? Can I hear an applause? Can I? Thanks. Yeah, I just wanted to do a little get ready with me for on a night out. It's my last night out in New York City. <sighs> I don't want to go home, okay? I love it here. I want to move to New York so freaking bad. So like rent in New York makes LA look cheap. I'm also running off of four hours of sleep last night and I'm slightly hungover. I went out last night, I looked... <laughs> I looked extremely good. Like last night I did a very golden goddess look. And also, okay, mini story time about last night. I am so stupid. Like I am so stupid. So if you're my mom or someone that cares about me, maybe don't watch this part. Um, I am really stupid. And usually I'm very safe. I'm very safe usually. I always keep an eye on my drink, like never let anyone talk, you know what I mean? Last night, so I was leaving like a club. Maybe I shouldn't actually say the name. I took a decent amount of shots. Okay, I know drinking underage, not good, not okay. Don't do it, guys. I'm not promoting it. I was drunk. And I'm just like, you know what? I need to leave. Like, it's 2 a.m. Like, I should go. So I walk outside and I'm just standing outside. I don't know what I was doing. I was, I really, I can't remember most of this. It's pretty blurry in my head. I'm talking to this guy and I'm just talking to him and he's like, oh, do you need a ride home? And so I say yes and I get into a car with a stranger. It, it's a Lamborghini eventual. But that doesn't matter. Like, he's still kind of kidding not me and killed me and I could have died and the stranger gave me a ride home so that was my getting home experience of last night that was my little uber ride five stars moral of the story don't drink don't get into strangers cars I may have turned out somewhat fine but looking back like that's terrifying anything could have happened to me okay let's go get ready my hair mask has been marinating long enough time right now I think it's coming up on 7 and I'm going out to dinner at 8 30 shower time <laughs> Okay, feeling fresh, feeling good, nice and clean. Ugh. Honestly guys, I am so tired. I had four hours of sleep last night, so I'm, I'm really tired. I just don't know what to do with my mental state right now. I, I blocked my ex this morning on everything. Being honest, yes, it's affected my mood. Am I gonna let it affect my mood? I'm gonna try and not. I'm just gonna carry on like normal. Hair is complete. I look fabulous. 
makeup time. I think today I'm gonna do like a red lip. I'm feeling schmancy. I'm so tired. I feel like I'm gonna pass out. Like, I mean, I know like it's my last night, so I wanna have fun. I need to ask the front desk on if I can do like a late checkout. Because the thing is, is my flight tomorrow is at 11 p.m. So I have like so much time to like chill and walk around New York City. I think I'm gonna do the red lip right now so I can see whether and decide like whether I wanna like do a winged eyeliner or not, or if I just wanna keep it like simple. Lip liner is MAC Cherry, and then the lipstick I'm gonna use is Dior. 999 I am so tired But I'm also really excited and like ready to take on the night too The car's gonna be here in 10 minutes Which is good because I just finished my makeup So I can just like put on my outfit Take a couple pictures and dip Outfit time! Mix it all together and you know that it's the best of both worlds <laughs> Okay, so the dress is on very cute, very fun, very fresh. But I mean, I do look absolutely divine. Perfume time, ooh. Mm, smells good. I'm wearing my Louboutin. These are gonna look so cute with it. Okay, so I think the car is like supposed to be here. I have my, um, my heels on and oh, yes, I know, I look fabulous, thank you. You can all comment it, I wanna hear the compliments. It's here. I look actually stunning. Like, I look like I'm, oh, look at this waist. Look at this face. Look at this. Skinny legend. <gasps> okay, I gotta go, it's waiting for me. I'll add in clip video clips of my night and what goes on. So yeah, bye. Guys, a little bathroom break. I'm having so much fun. <laughs> I literally just got escorted to the bathroom. Good morning. This is how I just woke up. I have my suitcases out, ready to pack and leave. I had a dream last night that I was like, okay, first of all, I was at the like 9 11 museum thing and then I was skiing. It was like really icy and slushy and I was in like a dress and Louis Vuittons. I was talking to the girl that I got cheated on with. I was like confronting her and asking her why she did it. And I was like sat really calmly and kindly and in my dream i said to her i was like it's taking a lot for me to not punch you in the face right now and she was like mm -hmm. and then she told me that she did it because she has nice hair it was a very weird dream to say the least 